Man, I gotta start using this song a little bit more. All right, what's happening, everyone? Jay Shock Blast here. We are live and direct, and I feel like I'm supposed to like grip the mic like I'm some kind of a singer. Um, but yeah, man. Uh, got a little DJ Chrome going on in the background. That's a boy. Might be loud. You might not be able to hear me. I don't care. That's enough of that. So hard stop. I'd love to like lower the levels as if I was like a DJ at a radio station. But what's happening, everyone? Jay Shock Blast here. And we're going to start off the stream a little bit different today. Let me start off by saying hi to everybody that's here so far. We've got Derry Fleming. We got Dark Side. Uh, we got Entity Default. Uh, we got Gaming Pizza. We got Breezy. Uh, what's up, Jessica Geruso? Uh, what's happening? Justin Santana, Gaming Pizza Spider, Christian Wayne, Kenny the Koala. Uh, we got Renegade X. We got Airborne. We got Philem Kafarki, uh, Chocolate Ice 21, Avenged Otter. Um, it's me, Jacobo, Commando Rex. And uh, thank you for saying happy birthday to my wife. It is my wife's birthday today. But uh, happy birthday to me because I've been wearing all my sports hats. That's basically what I mostly have. Usually I'm wearing my Worcester Red Sox hat. Right now I got on my Hartford Whalers hat. You're about to see my stupid hair because I got three new hats today, folks. Um, so I have three new hats today that I'll, you'll start seeing me wear on stream. And uh, let's start off with the first one. Excuse my awful hair. I've been wearing a hat all day. Boom. We got the Red Lanterns. Ah, it's a pretty sharp hat, right? Got uh, Atrocitus right there on the brim. So uh, I felt like I needed some new hats to wear on the stream. This one's a little tight. Uh, it's probably going to need to get broken in. I do have hair, right? Barely. Um, but yeah, anyway. I'm not bald. I just have stupid hair. Look, man. It's awful. It's like I've got hat hair. Like, seriously. I just actually got a haircut today. All right. Hat number two, which we'll be wearing on the stream today. All right. A little Thor action. Had to get Thor, right? All right. So, uh, there you go. I literally got a haircut today. It was awful. So... Uh, we'll be wearing this one pretty much today. All right, guys. Uh, this next hat, I'm probably never going to wear. And, and thank you, everybody, saying happy birthday to the shock wife. <laughs> All right. This hat right here is a hat I've been I've, I've literally wanted forever. It was super expensive. And that's why I didn't get it. But look at this. Look at this. It is a freaking Nova hat. All right, I'll show it off in a second. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put this one on. Look at this. How freaking awesome is that? All right. So that's the hat right there. Um, it was super expensive. I got it on like uh, superheroesstuff.com. And I think it was like real. Re when I, I saw it at New York Comic Con in 2017. And it was like $75. I think it's like $73 on eBay. I got it for like $53. It's way more than I want to pay for a hat. It's also a little too big. And I'm never going to wear it. This is literally going on display. Okay, but we got the Thor hat and uh, the underneath of the Red Lantern hat has Atrocitus. So those are going to be some hats that you see me wearing moving forward. Also, I got some comic books today. Let's go ahead and show those off real quick. I'll say hi to everybody in uh, just in a moment because I see a lot of people showing up right here. Spider-Woman, Jen Bartel cover. This is an Iron Man book with uh hellcat 
Patsy Walker. I don't even like Ultraman, but I thought this cover was just absolutely sick. So it's like Ultraman number one. And I just thought it was such an awesome looking cover. I just had to have it. Uh, we got this one right here, Thor number 13. Thought that was pretty clean. And Black Knight, Curse of the Ebony Blade. Again, another cover I just thought was absolutely amazing. Another one. This is a number one book. And again, just amazing artwork that I really loved. Uh, Deadpool number 18, a Rob Liefeld cover. It's got Deadpool, Cable, Wolverine on the cover. All right. Uh, right here. Uh, I think this is a Justice League number 59. But it's like got a Zack Snyder's Snyderverse cover. Who's Hellcat? Dude, did you not watch um, Jessica Jones? That was like Jessica Jones' best friend. Another Snyderverse cover. So I just thought those were really cool. And this is the last one right here. Uh, Justice League 59. I just thought it was a cool cover. So, so there we go, guys. Um, I just want to share. I like to share some of the stuff I get to start off the stream. Um, but, uh, I saw a lot of new people came in, um, everybody, uh, laughing at my awful hair. I'm sorry, man. You'll be there someday soon, uh, as well. Uh, anyway, um, I might've said hi to some of the people already, uh, Renegade X, uh, I see Iron Fist, John Hodge. Uh, let's go ahead and log in, by the way. Uh, hold on. Uh, it's me, Jacobo, is here. Carol Baskin, what's happening? Um, I think I said hi to Otter. Uh, Kenny, New Hat Alert. Uh, yes, thank you everybody again for the happy birthdays to the wife. Um, you thought I was bald. Hair reveal. It was awful. It was a bad hair day. Um, what's happening, uh, Jeremiah? Uh, what's happening? Uh, yeah, I know. $70 for a hat is crazy, right? Um, what's happening, John T? What's happening, LSU Tigers? Um, all right, we're gonna get we're gonna go in here in just a moment. What's happening, Nathan? What's happening, Green Machine? What's happening, Madman? Um, what's happening, Batfleck? Um, all right, cool. Congratulations for finally verifying your age on YouTube. So yeah, we're gonna be rocking the Thor hat now. What's up, uh, Wicked Wilson? All right, so let's just get right. Let's actually go get our quest again. Another day without you the uh, the Hulk quests or the the Maestro quests. Absolutely annoying. Yeah, they're doing E3 without a lot of companies uh, and online. Uh, have I watched Young Justice? I've seen a lot of Young Justice. I don't know that I've seen all of it. I started watching like the newer season, but I never really finished it. You're helping us win the fight against him. Uh, dude, Thursday is gonna be crazy. I have a doctor's appointment. Um, I have Borderlands DLC. We have uh, just so much going on. Um, plus Superior Iron Man. All right, so here we go. Heroic Gauntlet number one. No reason to not do it on the lower power. So let's get this thing going. What's happening? Plus Ultra. Uh, will Lego Star Wars be shown at E3? I have no idea. Marketplace changes Thursdays at noon or 1 o'clock? I forget. This will be a rewarding but grueling mission. When what is E3? Uh, it's usually in like June, I think. Point. Our best chance uh, for you're probably going to have to pay online. Will be to have Avengers ready to step in should yeah, man. Become this Nova hat. Pretty sick, I think. 27 likes already. Awesome. I appreciate you guys getting this off to a, a quick and early start. Uh, we're going to start melting people. Uh, Head for the location. All right, gauntlets. All right, yeah. All right. So we're going to start melting some people here. All right. Yeah, we got to get this to 100 likes. That's the goal every stream. But, you know... We'll take what we can get. I just appreciate that there are people here hanging out, having a good time. 
I'm actually really excited to be playing as Thor. These I have him at power 150 on uh, both consoles. So it's actually pretty rare that I use him. Is like absolute god level on ooh. I messed that up. God, I have not played Thor in a while actually. I got Black Widow Power 100. Hey, nice. The enemies um, have been defeated. Felt like. Thanks for reminding me of that, right? Um, just got home yesterday, last night, from a summer cabin. Also, somehow, cat in my room. You know, level 147. Nice. Uh, we've got two archers, so why not two Thors? I mean, there's only one Thor. And then there's other people that pretend to be Thor. Yeah, WB will be there, I'm sure, showing off everything that they can. 2K21 Mobile? I did not hear about that. Does Doesn't it seem like something I would play, though. Feels, uh, good. Feels right. Yeah. I do. New season of Rocket League tomorrow? Did I miss out on all the... Uh, all the stuff, all the Fortnite stuff in Rocket League. Here we go. What's up, Gaver man? Did you just say Jane Fonda? Jane Fonda, I can say, is definitely not Thor. Get smacked. There is only one Thor, and it is this guy right here. Jane Foster is definitely not Thor. She is Jane Foster pretending to be Thor. I don't really care about gear. You're on Switch? Oh, yeah, sorry. Breath of the Wild 2 news. These enemies must be defeated. No way that should be interrupted.
Oh, that was crap. Why is nobody reviving him? Why is this hitting so hard today? This is crazy. No way, man. He's I love how I'm sitting right next to a health pack and it's like not doing anything. I seem to be getting way harder with Thor than I normally do. It's crazy. What's happening? Hey, channel. Which Avenger? I'll Thor. I'm definitely a Thor guy. I just honestly, I haven't played Thor in so long because I have like, I got him to 150 so fast that um, I'm just rusty. I haven't played him in a long time. Plus I have him at 150 on two different platforms. The Fortnite challenges end on the 8th, 9th. Okay. I'll try to remember. Your weapons are impressive. Yours too. You want to trade? No. Would you recommend this game for fans of Marvel Ultimate Alliance? It's very different. I mean, if you're a Marvel fan in general, I think you'll like it. Um, but it's definitely not anything like Ultimate Alliance. Show up my loadout for Thor, Brian. Yeah, I mean, I haven't used them in a while, so I might not have the best loadout on this one. I think my Destroy Xbox loadout is probably better. Do a little spin to win. Then spam all that. Jesus. I love it when I'm getting like shot at from like all the way across the the map by people when there's others like closer by. Like, there's three others over there fighting them, but, like, the computer knows to shoot at me. That power core is finished. <laughs> Hello, YouTube user. Uh, what's happening, JMac Gaming? Cream Cheese Bagel. Uh, he is the real bagel. the type of damage I want for this weapon. Basically, the way that I, I run him is you gotta, like, spin up the hammer and it builds up charge. And then you don't even have to hit the enemy. You just, like, throw it in their enemy and then just spam 
your uh, intrinsic, your power, and it'll just light them up. I don't usually love having shock power though. Uh, usually, I must have something that is like helping with shock power, but I usually like to have like cosmic power if possible. I think I have like a cosmic um, Mjolnir on um, on Xbox, but I don't think I have the best gear on my my PlayStation account. Um, actually, let's look at it right now. It's happened in Valentin Prez. I did watch uh, the Snyder Cut. It was it was okay. All right. Uh, so this one heavy chance heavy combo finishes grant short defense buff. Signature attack steal shock damage. Ten percent Odin force. Let me just get rid of some of this so it doesn't. It's all just gonna go to the bank anyway. I would not hate like finding some better gear. There's a part of me that wants to get like a an exotic for um. For Hawkeye, but I may just run this whole thing with Thor if I can. Alright. Let me just see what we got here. I don't think any of this is that great. Yeah, was, I would definitely like to get something better than that. Yeah, I think I have terrible gear on him right now. 27% chance hitting enemy with ranged critical attack triggers anti gravity field. Pin enemies take particle damage. I mean, that one's okay. Certainly not ideal. But um, I, pro I probably was just in a hurry trying to like get myself to power 150 with him and just kind of settled. Who's more powerful, Dark Phoenix or Scarlet Witch? That's tough to say, man. Like, I would say probably Scarlet Witch in a lot of ways. Um, it's happening, Axel. So I, uh, hear you and Tony are in a prank war? <laughs> cool. Uh, maybe. Wow, you are an awful liar. Head for the location on your HUD. I don't care about really any of the gear drops along the way. I really just want to like rush through this. We're on floor three of six. We have to do 40 floors to complete this. Oh God, I did this wrong. Oof, I love the choke slam one. There's a finisher that Thor has. It's like a choke slam. Like almost like he's the Undertaker. See how like, I, I basically spin the win right there? Oh wow, I didn't even realize I didn't have Mjolnir in my hand. Oh god. Yeah, it does destroy us, right? Basically, you just have to sp um, spin the hammer like this. So hold down left trigger, then right trigger, and then you throw it and just spam right trigger. 
that move right there is usually going to just absolutely annihilate people. Uh, yo, what's happening, Mosiah? Yo, Mosiah, speaking of Nova, hold on. Did you see my new hat? Speaking of Nova. All right, you're going to see my stupid hair real quick. Ready for this? Look at this hat. Look at that. Look at that. Dude, I am Nova. Right there. Look at this. Pretty clean, right? So we showed those off at the beginning of the stream. I got a couple new hats today. Doing pretty good, Lord Shadows. How are you today? We're just chilling. Yo, Jacobo. Jacobo is about to lose the wrench. He's about to give Kenny your wrench. He's gonna have double wrenches. Uh hmm guy, yes, I always I, I like I always wear a hat. There's like I don't know. I've just I've always been a hat guy, you know? Um, but my hair is just like all I just got it cut today. And it's like definitely not like it's not like um, all set up right. I can infiltrate their security system. Aim will attempt to initiate a shutdown protocol if they gain So like I didn't do my hair, it's like ha serious hat hair. Thank you. Oh god. Come on, get over it. Aim has initiated their shutdown protocol. Come on. Beginning infiltration. The shutdown protocol is progressing. I'm inside AIM security system. Beginning infiltration. That helps, thank you. Oh God. The shutdown protocol is progressing. AIM has initiated their shutdown protocol. Gotta wait for this to hit red. AIM is trying to remove me from their system. Oh my God, this guy is really pissing me off. I've breached AIM security network. Ooh, that was brutal. Tapping uh, the boss of 2K. Uh, I like the <laughs> like the cut it cut G. Gotcha. Thanks. Uh, tapping His Majesty. Tapping Rochelle. Um, never eaten one bagel oh i mean i honestly was never into bagels until uh my wife moved in um so she loves bagels and we i mean i don't have them all the time but like i like there's like a a i think it's like an asiago cheese bagel she gets that i like oh and thank you for saying happy birthday to my wife um does anyone have thor yeah, comic recommendations oh my god Dude, get the new Donny Cates run and just start there. I freaking love it. 
I love this Thor skin as well. Um, so the recent Donnie Cates run is really good. Oh god. There are a lot of people here. So yeah, I absolutely love the new Donny Cates run. Um, War of the Realm is really good. Unworthy Thor is really good. Um, where he's basically like trying to become worthy again. Um, so basically, the I think it was Jason Aaron. Uh, his run was pretty good. Uh, Donny Cates just started doing it uh, very recently. Uh, in the last like two years. That run was really good. Basically, uh, Harold, Harold Thor is awesome i didn't really have to fight all that Ooh, croissants are pretty good too what's up col uh colby uh what did i give her for a gift every member of the elite team um so she team. did not really want a gift um but i did get her something it just hasn't come in yet uh we like to watch this uh tv show on mtv called the challenge and one of the guys on the challenge is Johnny Bananas. And she really likes Johnny Bananas, even though I do not. And um, I got her a hoodie, one of his hoodies. But I also made her like a bomb dinner. I made uh, sausage, bacon, eggs, home fries, biscuits. It was like insane, there's so much. Gotta be really careful not to die. What's happened, Dragon God? Uh, did, I, did I show her the card he made? Um, I, I mentioned it. I didn't show it to her. Oh, God. I mentioned that we have dubbed her the Shock Wife. Yeah, I like making breakfast for dinner. But uh, it was pretty a pretty intense meal. All right, so that was uh, pretty hard. Not really hard, but. As I showed everyone yesterday, here's a uh, pretty funny of her with uh, Thor. Look at how Thor is just sitting there like a total creep ball, right? Just like, psh, <laughs> sitting there like a human. Jigs is like, what are you doing? So, yeah. The shock wife. <laughs> we just made like the, the biscuits where they're like in the tube and you have to like crack it, pop it open. Uh... Yeah, Agatha wouldn't approve. Yeah, that's that's Thor and Jigs. So the boxer is Thor, and the other dog is was my dad's dog, Jigs. Um, he is part American Bulldog and part um, American Eskimo dog. What's happening, Nina? Yes, thank you. Uh, I think she had a pretty good birthday. You know, she's a teacher, so she had to go to school. Um, but everybody was good to her. Uh, her parents stopped by. We hadn't seen them in a little while. Um, because, you know, we're trying to, like, follow all the rules. So it's nice to see them. I like I like my in-laws. They're really nice. They're really good to us. Good to me.
god. See the Spider-Man picture you made? Um, I think I did. I'll look in a sec. Is it uh, on Discord, right? Pretty sure I saw. It. There's a lot of stuff going on today, so you posted like right away last night, right? I do think I remember seeing it. Sorry, I'm just in like the thick of things right here. The enemies have been All right. It was in shock chat, right? A lot of people posting today, which is always good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Was that in, um, in Spider-Man PS4? That's cool. It's always fun to play around with photo mode. Always fun to do that. Excellent work. You've dealt enough. Yeah, golden retrievers are cool. You're not finished yet. Man, there's some nice side chats going on in here. <laughs> All right, what did I get out of that? No one cares, Dragon God. They're here for me, bro. You should not be self-promoting in other people's streams. It is uh, frowned upon. So, all right. Let's see. I just have to go cry. I don't want to do cryo damage. Yeah, I don't really like any of the gear I have right now, to be honest with you. I finished the challenge card, apparently, but... Oh, I did not finish his challenge card on this. Well, that's something to strive for. What do we got to do here? Defeat ten enemies before... After... Oh, I don't want to do that one. Let's... Defeat five more enemies. Oh, perfect. Um... Sound like a real movie with the AirPods? <laughs> Uh, it's quite front. Yeah, it is. Seriously. Um, oh, yeah. Baked goods are, are my, like, Achilles heel. Defeat I only did one takedown that whole time? That's crazy. I can't believe I didn't finish out Thor's challenge card. I didn't even realize that. All right. Let's change skins. All right. Let's take Carol Baskins out on a date here. I'm going to go with the Rockstar skin. All right. Select a mission. <laughs> that is a real war zone, yeah. Alright. Uh, this is uh, gauntlet number two. Definitely uh, want to play it safe here. Dude, it's Carol Baskin's date night, Thor. Don't pretend you don't like it. Look at this. I don't like it either, to be honest. Be careful out there. We're all counting on you. Faction level up. Josh Whedon's career is over. He definitely had a bad day. Head for the location on your HUD. Oh God. You fall to the sun of the other side. These enemies must be defeated. Oh, 
Just bear with me when I'm in these intense battle sequences. Oh god. Crazy. What wizarding house am I? I don't even know. Slytherin? I, I... We'll see you, Superior Chris. Thanks for stopping by, bud. Uh, what's happening, Mr. Top Chicken Nugget? Uh, new so-called leaks on Black Panther comes out August, September. Um, I mean, if Miller said it, I would believe it. What's happening, Braden? I'd pretty much believe anything Miller says. Uh, did I change third Let suit? Let me guess, they're calling you the king Fourth now? suit, yes. I'm gonna change yeah. his suit Just keep often. Calling grandparents this is a uh, Carol Baskin oh, date night Thor. Funny. Like, this is literally what Thor would wear on a date with, uh, Carol Baskin. We'll see a cream cheese, or I'm sorry, Kenny. I try to like peek my eye over at chat when I'm like in the middle of combat, but I don't really want to die. My day's been pretty good. Waiting for the new Batman game. Yeah, it's not gonna be till next year, unfortunately. But I feel you there. Uh, what's happening, uh, James Rhodes? Who would I like them to introduce to the game for hero villain? Um, I mean, I'm really looking forward to Black Panther, obviously. Um, I think Captain Marvel will be great. Obviously, if I could get uh, like a dream scenario, never gonna happen. If I could get Nova. Do your clothes get like look at that. super staticky? Aye. If we get Nova in the game, goodness. that would be awesome. Dude, I feel you. Head for the location on Why your is Sp uh, Spider-Man Miles Morales so short? They kind of always said that it was. Uh, I'm I'm not putting you in timeout. The mods are putting you in timeout. Um, I am cool, but I mean I think you're trying to self-promote, so. That's probably why they're putting you in timeout. Like, you can see I'm playing a video game, right? Like, I'm on the screen. What's up, Captain Dexter? These enemies Thank you, Alpro. We will uh, definitely tell her happy birthday from everybody. Sorry, I had a niche.
Oh, I love this one right here. Love that one. That one's one of my favorite. Uh... Oh my god. Why am I getting attacked by somebody else? Oh, I hate this guy. Oh god, I need health. happened Declan and thank you again to everybody that's wishing my wife a happy birthday God how many of these guys have to fight That was intense. Um, Thor's hammer sounds kind of like a peach ball. <laughs> oh man, what's happening, Jay Conk? Guys, the uh, the the action on screen right now is pretty intense. So I'm just trying to like, I promise you, I will look at your comments when I'm not like in the middle of uh, getting absolutely smacked up here and there. Um, so anyway. Uh, what's happening to Taurus? Um, make sure I said hi to everybody that's here. What's happening to uh, Drayson Britt? Uh, Thor is the savage, I agree. I love Hulk more, better. I did Your a suit glitch. Uh, what's happening to Deacon Montrell? Uh, you know, there will be uh, another Saw movie? Interesting. I'm not, a big, I'm not a horror movie fan at all. Oh, is this still glitched? Let's wear the glitched outfit. I think that looks awesome. Has a server bank nearby. Fan club arrived today. Nice. Very happy for you to have that honor. Uh, it's my wife's birthday today, but yes, thank you. Uh, again, I really appreciate everybody. Um, wishing her a happy birthday. There they are. Neutralize them. What's up, uh, Manuel? When am I returning more Comet 11? Aim will throw everything at you to keep their servers intact. Destroy them all. That's a, a interesting question. I'm not, um... I feel like I've done everything that I can do in Mortal Kombat. That's the big problem. As much as I love it, I really do. Been destroyed. Um, I just don't really know what else I have that I can do, you know? I'm certainly not the type of person you want to watch to play the game because I'm not that great. Um, I like to showcase the characters. That's really always been my my kind of deal. So, like, and, and they're pretty much done with it at this point. Um, new content, that is. Yo, it's happening, Manny. I I do play Fortnite. Lately, I've only been doing it on Friday, though, because, like, there's nothing really new to show. And Friday night, I play with everybody that wants to play.
Sorry about your damn luck. Excellent. Aim server bank is down. Yeah, Friday night Fortnite we do that. Uh, what's happening? Uh, spent this night. They just added a new gun to Fortnite. Oh, I saw that, but I don't really know that. Like, there's definitely stuff I like to do in Fortnite, but I don't know that I'm the most interesting Fortnite person. Yeah, I can't unhear the beach ball. That's funny. Yeah, I got. I always have Kamala with me. She's like the best support character. Yo, what's happening, Valber? Yo, Valber, did you see my new hat? Look at this. Hold on. So we got the new Thor hat, but we also got the Nova hat. Look at that. Updating your HUD. Look at that. Some sharp hat, right? Also got wherever I put it. Ah, here we go. My new uh, Red Lanterns hat. So, yeah, pretty pretty hyped about those. So. With gear close by. There we go. Uh, what's happening, uh, Alvin? Wish they made a music video of Thor as a savage hut. I, oh, dude, I, I try so hard to make sure I say everybody's name right. But, I mean, really, it just takes reading comprehension, right? You would think. Like, I can see that it's spelled Spensis and not Spencer. So, you know. It, I think it's important to make sure you try to, like, make an attempt. Like, I'm not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but, um, you know, I don't think your name is that hard, but... Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh! Health, 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 health. Give me health. and Meister G. You're more of a... I mean, I like uh, Saint Walker. I just love... I love Atrocitus, man. Like, I just... Be, like, just such a huge fan of Atrocitus. You know, I love... Ble um, not Bleez. Uh, Dexstar's story. So... I hate when kids get hurt. Oh, yeah. That looks even better. It's happening Tasha Williams. Uh, the A's... The A's in my name are silent, actually. Oh. Wait, what? Are you messing with me? Vlibber Produx. You still thinking about that story? Oh, I you can't even, like, pretend accurate. to say that. Okay. Jacobo is my name is actually silent. You're gonna write your own All right, it's me. If you can gain control of AIM's network... Yo, why are you guys messing with me? I can infiltrate their security system. What armor is that? So, Don't apparently, worry. this is a glitch, okay? Um, the... The armor is the tungsten, and apparently all that blue is not supposed to be there. It's kind of like a glitched out armor. So we're rocking it, you know? Um, I love this Lightbreaker. I'm just going to switch Thor. Uh, I know, I know. I'm just going to switch the outfits, um, like, constantly. Head for the terminal so I can get you inside the lab. I actually like the... Oh god, oh god.
Uh, it does look sick, right? Ames network is equipped with a multi-point authentication. I started a meme. Look at my. I need access comment. to multiple terminals. The more, the better. Oh, I hate this room. What do we have to do? Just break them? Aim will attempt to initiate a shutdown uh, protocol if they gain access to the sucks. terminals. This one sucks. You cannot let them. <laughs> Beginning infiltration. <laughs> The shutdown protocol is progressing. I'm inside AIM security system. Beginning infiltration. That helps, thank you. to remove me from their system. That helps, thank you. The shutdown protocol is progressing. I'm inside AIM security system. God. To remove me from their system. Guys are annoying. Helps, thank you. I'm inside AIM security system. Sorry, guys, this is intense. I'm in intense J mode right now. Beginning infiltration. I don't know, I might have wasted that. I'm inside AIM security system. Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Whew, good thing that ended when it did because I was toast. Those three were going to absolutely ruin my night. Um, what's happening, Roku? I wish more of Thor's outfits had the helmet. Yeah, I don't disagree with that. I, I think that's a fair point. Um... Uh, tapping Raging Raven. It is tense, right? Like, I'm, like, so focused and serious. But, uh, you know, one time... Like, if I die with Thor, that's it. I can't use him again. I'm gonna have to get through it with Captain America, Hawkeye, or Hawkeye. We got the Aquaman Cup tonight. Since we have a lot of new people that join the chat, excellent work. Um, You've dealt I've been showing off my to hats tonight. You're not finished uh, yet. But I also got some comics today, so maybe you guys want to see those. Um, so here's some of the co comics I got. Uh, right here we have Justice League number 59. I thought I thought that cover was really cool. Shazam and, and Superman. Looks like Vixen maybe. Actually. Who is who is this right here? Um, does anybody know, know who she is? I think it doesn't actually look like it's Vixen. I'm not 100% positive on her. Um, we got this one right here. Uh, Justice League 59 again. Uh, this is a Zack Snyder cut cover. And this one again. Another Zack Snyder cover. Oh, thanks, Falber. Uh, we got this one right here. X-Force number 18. A Rob Liefeld cover. Deadpool, Wolverine, and Cable on the cover. I mostly like them just for the covers. Uh, it's Bumblebee? Oh, okay, perfect. Uh, Black Knight number one. Uh, I thought that was a cool cover. I like to get number ones, too, because I think they might be worth something. Uh, I loved this cover right here. Black Knight and the Curse of the Ebony Blade, number one. So I thought that was a really clean cover. 
And this one right here as well. Uh, Thor, number 13. Very classic looking cover. Uh, all right, I don't know anything about Ultraman whatsoever, but I just thought that cover was like so cool, and I don't know, like it's a it's a number one issue, uh, from Marvel Comics, so I thought that was really cool. Uh, right here, this is Iron Man, but it has this is a Jen Bartel cover, and it has Hellcat, and then last one, uh, Spider Woman. I think it's like Woman's History Month or something like that. So, that one's pretty cool, too. Anyway, Ebony Blade is also in Skyrim, yeah. Ultraman is awesome. I need more comics, but the stores are all shut. Oh, that sucks. Uh, I appreciate you guys. Like, honestly, all the, the kind words are really awesome. Uh, I really do appreciate that. But I guess I was wrong. It was not Vixen. It was Bumblebee. I do not know a lot about Bumblebee, uh, if I'm being honest. Um, so that was, uh, definitely cool. What do we get here? I don't have the best gear for Thor. I, on, on this account, my Xbox account, I definitely have better gear. Like, I know I have, like, a really sick cosmic Mjolnir. Uh, all right, what do we get here? Increased damage to signature attacks. Increased... Chance defeating enemy grants a defense. Ooh. Oh, God. We're putting this one on for sure. Yeah, this one is definitely going to be a lot better, I think. We have plenty of mats. I only know Bumblebee from Teen Titans. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, Deacon, uh, Deacon Montreal Jackson, I agree with you completely. All of you guys in chat are amazing. Like these these Avengers chats late uh, streams lately have honestly been so much fun. It brings me back to the Marvel Heroes Omega days. Cause remember when we used to stream on Marvel Heroes Omega? We have tons of people here. We all just hang out and nerd out about comic books and like all the characters we love and and stuff like that. Like that to me is why I love doing stuff like this. You know, um, what's happening, Disciple? Um, too many blue names now, <laughs> but, um, I can never like, it's like a blur sometimes. Um, yeah, my sir, um, if you got to spend the entire day with Thor, Deadpool or Nova, who would I choose? I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, probably Thor because Deadpool would probably find a way to get me killed. Nova, I feel like would just be too serious. Like he's just very intense and at least Thor, like, Thor might get me killed. He might just get me drunk. Um, might let me just hang out with Volstag all day and just eat. I mean, you never know what you're going to get with Thor. So I'd probably choose Thor. Love watching Marvel's Avengers. Yeah, man. Like, I love the game. <laughs> Dude, gaming pizza, I'd probably give you the wrench to at some point. But I just don't want a wall of wrenches, you know? Be careful out there. We're all counting on you. What's happening, Mosiah? That was the great thing about uh, the Marvel Heroes days. Like, that's why I have 1,200 people on my friends list and, like, 600 people waiting to be on my friends list because, like, I would just add everybody, right? And, you know, I would just love to let everybody join the game and run people through stuff. It was so easy for people to join in. It's, it's a little harder to do that in this game because like it's just I feel like whenever I'm uh I feel like whenever I try to get like a lot of people in the game it just takes forever and I hope they can fix that to make it easier That's probably like the number one reason why I don't love this. Like I love playing with people because obviously people are better than the AI. Um, but it just takes so long. And then I end up with like so much dead, 
dead air, basically. So you gotta understand, like, I have a background in radio. Like, when I was in college, I used to do college radio, so, like, I kind of know, like, the way that, like, you know, you don't want to have, like, a lot of dead space and a lot of dead air. So, like, when I'm sitting there waiting for, like, a bunch of people to join and stuff, um, you know, it's, it's hard because, like, it's boring, you know? Like, me sitting here waiting for things to load is not what people want to watch, you know? Uh, yeah. R.I.P. Zebra Shirt Thor, right? Uh, do I have the trophies? That, um, oh my god. Oh, Meister. Hold on. Do you want to see something heartbreaking, Meister? All right. Hold on real quick. Let me switch you over to Xbox real quick, okay? Um... Let me show you something that's going to break your heart. Look at this. I have 36 of 37 achievements, okay? 36 of 37 achievements right there, right? Do you want to know what the one achievement that I don't have is? Let me show you the one achievement I don't have. Earned all other Marvel Heroes Omega achievements. How is that possible? That's the only achievement I don't have is the one to earn all the other achievements, which I have. Right? I have them. Every single one of them. 36 of 37. The only one I'm missing. The only one I'm missing is to have them all. I've talked to Xbox about it. They will not do anything. They won't unlock it. And it killed 0.01% have this achievement. It's literally the only achievement I don't have. And they can't do anything about it. It blows my... It is pain. It is so much pain. And it... it it drives me crazy. And you know what the worst part is? Like, when you go into, like, uh, rest mode on the Xbox, um, it will it will slowly... Like, eventually, the blade on the side will pop up. No, Xbox won't unlock it. Um, so, um, every, like, every so often, it'll show me, like, like the next achievements that I need to... Uh, to unlock and it'll show me that one like all the time and it like it kills me it is it's like a constant reminder of what i cannot have you know so much pain and it's like can't you read it says have all the other achievements clearly i have all the other achievements why can't you just unlock it Like, you would think that would just be, like, a Captain Obvious thing. So yeah, uh, I want to spend money on this game, but I'm scared that the game ba player base will cut out before the four years. No, I feel you, and that's always a risk. Um, but I would say, did you have fun doing it? And I know everybody's you know financial situation is always going to be different, and maybe some people aren't in a position to like. Um, you know, make that kind of investment with the possibility of losing it. But, you know, I feel you there. It's easier for me because it's a tax deduction, you know? Like, at the end of the day, it's do I spend money on the game or do I give the U.S. government, you know, more tax dollars? Because this is my business, you know? So there's like a famous song on YouTube, like, um, where a dude's like, I bought this guitar so that uh, I can claim it on my taxes 
I don't I don't know the name of the song, but basically the, the gist of it is I only bought this, you know, to claim it on my taxes. So I mean, for someone like me, it's a little bit easier because I'm investing in the channel, you know? Um, not super easy, because I still gotta make the money to spend the money, but I don't know. I'd rather, I'd rather spend it there than with the, with the, the people that aren't gonna pay. Oh God, oh God. Aren't gonna use it the way I would want it to be used. Skins yesterday, yeah. Which which ones did you get, uh, Jacobo? Yo, Dragon God, my man, what are you doing, bro? Like, you wonder why you get put in timeout and then you like spam. I mean, like, I don't know what your deal is, bro. Wow, there's still more of them? I don't think, like, I feel like skins should be pretty easy to make. You know, all things considered, it's just artwork and finding a way to put it in the game. I kind of feel like they're not that complicated, but you can't compare two companies. Like, every company has a right to choose the way to do it. Uh, <laughs> tapping into Brown Bull. Um, yeah, I have seen it. Um, if you guys don't follow uh, URS Rock Rider on Twitter, uh, he did this cool little poster. So that's coming. Does also, I'm leaving this here guys? because I think it's it, absolutely it's hysterical. On so, no, then. I know you're here, Dracula, you big <laughs> fucking nerd. Where's my goddamn money? Love Moon Knight. It's not real, by the way, obviously. Um, anyway, uh, good to know I'm not the only person who feels that way. Yeah. We shall uh, Unworthy Thor is one of my personal faves. Um, I like it. I don't love it, but I do like it. Um, especially when most of them reuse. Yeah, exactly. What MCU skins would I want to see? Um, it's a great question. Uh, I definitely want to do, um, like, I feel like a lot of the skins I want that are MCU skins have already kind of been done. So, I would obviously want to see two skins from Thor Ragnarok, uh, for Thor. Uh, I would want the, um, the Roadborn Thor skin, which is the one, oh, I have not been in this room before. These enemies must be defeated. Oh, interesting. I mean, I've been in this room before, but not in a hive. Um, anyway, the the outfit he's wearing at the beginning of the movie where he's got like the red hood, it, it's a little similar to this one. Um, obviously, I want the, uh, the gladiator Thor as well. And I would love the Gladiator Hulk from uh, Thor Ragnarok as well. And I know, again, we also already have the Gladiator skin. But I still kind of would want that version. Um, and then I would love... Oh, God. I don't realize he was there. I would love it if we had... Um, um, the Ronin from uh, Avengers Endgame. Which again, I know we already have a Ronin skin too, but it's like, you know, these are the skins that I like. I would love it if we got a Black Widow skin, the white Black Widow skin from her movie. And obviously I'm sure they're holding off on that. You like the old, I think Old Man Hawkeye should have been a level 50 skin. 
so nice to be playing Thor again. Illustrious Iron Man, Captain Flint, Scale. Hold on, let me let me get through this room and then I'll read chat. The enemies have been defeated. All right. Um. Let's see. How the heck you guys have highlight names? If you do like at in the person's name, I think it highlights their name usually. You bought it when Hawkeye was released. You went to go get water. What happened? I put on chapstick. Oh, man. I wish they gave you a skin at level 50 for Hawkeye and Kate. Didn't they give you one for Kate? I don't remember. I thought they did. They're not now because they're doing a... I don't know, whatever they're calling it. A rework. I... But can't say that she has. Even Jay. So it should have been free. I yeah, it should have been free. I bought it too on uh, Xbox. Like there are certain skins I'll buy on both platforms, but I don't want to buy all of them on both platforms. And I don't even actually like the old man Hawkeye if I'm being honest. Like that skin wasn't really. I bought it on stream because somebody wanted to see it. So. They should have made his hair longer. Aim will throw everything at you to keep their servers intact. Destroy them all. Your defeat was Happened in I Dark Side DC. Agent so Phil Coulson in the house. Ooh, he got his day ruined. Ooh, I had my day ruined. the player base looking like now honestly i just play by myself for the most part so i don't even really think about the player base i think that obviously i've been getting a lot of people watching so i'd like to think that the player base is pretty good i mean i feel like people want to watch the game and they want to play the game and enjoy, enjoy it but i think there's always going to be spikes in the player base when the new content comes out uh because at the end of the day you know you can walk away from the game for a little bit and just come back, you know, when the new content comes out. There's nothing that says you have to play it 24 hours a day, seven days a week, you know? Thought for sure I was about to die. Longer hair for who, Hawkeye? These are the most useless suits in Marvel Avengers shirtless. Oh, God, yeah. I think... I think one, like... Like, this, this suit right here, I think, is fine. This one, I think, is okay. But, like, this one is dumb, you know? I can live with this one right here. I think that one's kind of funny, actually. And this one's actually kind of cool, too. Sparky's Power and Light. Um, actually, I like this one. So I disagree. Most of these are actually cool. <laughs> um, I hate people that are like, oh, dead game. 
Like that, it's it's so stupid. All right, defeat five more enemies. Takedowns, okay. I can't believe I don't have a challenge card down here. Cause I'm, <laughs> which Thor skin did you get? And also, isn't it like a lot of fun to say Thor skin? I mean, you know you guys are gonna think about that now. Do your parents worry about you being an Avenger? Uh, and you're welcome for that. Really in the picture anymore. An elite AIM team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. AIM has arrived. You cheat for the challenge cards? Hey, that's fine, man. To each their own. There is no such thing as cheating. You just play the game, enjoy it for yourself. Look for a chest with gear nearby. What's happening, Beast Boy? War Machine DLC canceled. So, I mean, technically you can't cancel something that you never announced. So, of the elite team I mean, I know defeated. Miller decoded it and everything, but I don't, I hesitate to say canceled, right? So, I mean, I think, I think the better way to put it is it was planned at one point and now it might not be uh, planned anymore. But I mean, I know what you're saying. I love the way the armor like starts to fall apart now. That was cool. One of their agents is down. Another agent down. Well done. That squad member has been neutralized. It's such a huge pet peeve when people are like, oh, are we going to get X-Men in this game? Are we going to get Avengers in this game? Or, I mean, uh, like, Fantastic Four in this game. It's like, bro, read the title of the game. It's Marvel's Avengers, my man. I think mutants clearly don't exist. <laughs> yeah, right. I don't think a game is dead until people don't make it anymore, you know? But even then, if people want to play it, then um, who cares, you know? Like, if people want to play a game, I, it, does it really affect anybody anymore? else? It is for formal occasions. Can I wear it to prom? If you can gain control of AIM's network temporarily, I, believe he I can infiltrate is next after Black Panther system. than She-Hulk. I... I don't know. I don't know who to really, uh... Head for the terminal so I can get you inside the lab. I don't really know what order it's supposed to be. I thought Spider-Man would be after Black Panther. And I kind of hope that Carol Danvers follows. I need access to multiple terminals. The more the better. You ranked YouTubers and I'm number three? I'll settle with that. I mean... It's pretty, pretty damn good, I think. AIM will attempt to initiate a shutdown protocol if they gain access to the terminals. You cannot let them. Beginning infiltration. on that. Mm. 
I hate these server room ones. Because I feel like my teammates never help. Oh, come on. The shutdown protocol is progressive. Security network. One division would be old news by then. Yeah, you'd rank me number one gaming pizza, dude. I'm gonna screen grab that and show it to Blitzwinger. Ha! Ah. Tap it in Jordan Goku. Uh, she Hulk series coming to yeah. I just hope this game doesn't have a short lifetime. I think, look, I think the biggest thing is once once they get back in the studio, things are just going to get better. Like, that's just my biggest thing, is they just got to get back in the studio. You know, I feel like we're, like, probably a month Excellent or two away You've dealt from, from, from getting there. Eight. You're not finished um, yet. I don't know. California is so such a wild card, so maybe I'm wrong. I'm bragging to Blitzwinger? Yeah, you know. You know how it is. Dude, gaming pizza is definitely a... I would have thought Gaming Pete's would have me at least at number two. So, uh, what I so say? Uh, I'm hoping that the game loses support before we get uh, Captain Marvel. Don't judge Captain Marvel. Uh, we'll see, you, Otter. Thanks for stopping by, man. Don't judge Captain Marvel based on the movie, okay? I understand there are a lot of people that don't love Brie Larson. And that's fine. Um, but Carol Danvers is a good character. I mean, you wouldn't know it if you read Civil War 2, but Carol Danvers is a great character. What do we got here? Yeah, this isn't going to be good for me. Um, but Carol Danvers is a really good character. What's happening, Martin Torres? I'm kidding. I'm not going to show that to Blitzwinger. I don't think he would care anyway. Um, I thought the movie was okay. I really hate their portrayal portrayal of Marvel. Doesn't lose. Okay, I got you. That makes way more sense. I mean, it was okay. Don't get me wrong. I don't love portraying the Kree. I'm not the Kree. The um, the scrolls as good guys. I mean, I don't think she's an awful Captain Marvel, but I understand that people are turned off by her attitude. Um, she doesn't always have the best attitude, I don't think. What do we got? 87 likes? Nice. If we can get there to, to 100, that would be dope. A tie between me and Blitz? I'll settle for that. Like, I really think Blitz should be number one on your list, though. I feel like, but who am I? I am I am honored though. Carol Denver tried to kill my Yeah, exactly. But there were a few situations like that. I Be I understand why people maybe maybe Brie Larson is a little misunderstood. And I understand that, you know? Um I understand what she's trying to do, what she's trying to say, those type of things. Head for the location but uh, there are just times that I don't think it comes out right. Jude Law should have been Marvel. I kind of don't disagree with that. Like, I think that's one of my, my big issues is just Marvel is like a powerhouse in the Marvel Universe, you know? And just to like, like do a, a whole gender swap. Well, I appreciate that, Meister. I've used. Oh, you know what? I feel you, pizza. 
See, I that was big brain right there. That was These all part of my plan. To use Oops Monkey as much as possible and earn the hearts of millions. Well, hundreds of thousands anyway. Uh, you know, Dean, a.k.a. Unlimited Magic. I don't know him. Um, obviously, I've played Among Us with him in Blitzbringer streams. I didn't really know who he was before that. Um, but, I mean, obviously, I know who he is. Um, I like Bree and other projects more, like Scott Pilgrim. I haven't seen 21 Jump Street. Uh, heard about the theory that they gender swapped Taskmaster. I doubt it. They, I doubt it. I don't like it when you do that. I think that's a dude. Thing. I feel like you're gonna. That's people that have too much time. What's happening, Ezekiel I'm Brewer? I hope they had add Scarlet Witch one division costume. Oh, the dude, the one division costume is so sick. And guys, I, I, I promise you, I'll try to get to everybody's comments. Um, so please don't get offended if I miss it. Um, I'm doing, doing my best. Use the oh my god, Nick Fury is here too? <laughs> oh my god, I don't want to attack that. I want to use this. Nick Fury. What are my thoughts on Falcon Winter Soldier? Love it. Absolutely love it. I think it's fantastic. I, I literally can't wait, you know? Consider me offended. What did I miss? The one of his costume is fantastic. Destroy I already pre-ordered the hot toy. Oh my god. I hate it when it, it like tells you to do a you could do a takedown and then you can't. The question is, did Nick Fury just catch Phil Coulson playing Galaga? Didn't and we he didn't think we noticed. Which Disney Plus show do you like one of it? I like them both. Like, I'm not, I would never pick between either one of them either. Uh, I already pre-ordered both the the Scarlet Witch and Vision hot toys from WandaVision. All power 
cool is destroyed. Yeah, a lot. Well Dude, done. one of my friends, Valver, was trying to, like, convince me that the last episode was the worst episode. And I'm like, bro, you are tripping. His reasoning was that, like, how do you go to Mandrapur and, like, just your, your setting is a bar and a bunch of shipping containers. It's like, bro, they were in Mandrapur for, like, 15 minutes. Like, why would they invest heavily in, in Mandrapur if they're just there for a quick, like, a quick high and buy? He's like, oh, you can't, like, story. introduce Mandrapur like that, that not, like, okay. do it up big. Like, why would you do that? Can it's like, but, like, campaign? you're only there for a few minutes. For That's why. I didn't understand his reasoning at all. It made no sense. Once they reveal Sam Cap, we'll probably get it. Nice. Oh, come on. He wasn't even there yet. There's like no reason to fight any of these guys at all. Dude, I he's also one of those type of people that got mad about the ending of WandaVision because he fan theoried things in his head. After these we're done with this, I will uh I'm gonna show you guys the hot toy figure from uh WandaVision. Dude, we wrecked them. Oh my god. Cool, I'm attacking Cape Bishop. Yeah, I think there's a lot of overhyped expectations going around though. And that's one of the things that I think is so hard to like manage. It's like, dude, everything's fine. You just expected way too much. And I think it's fair because like the, the quality of the content is so good. Poor guy, sorry about your luck. The enemies have been defeated. Yo, what's happening? Unbox junkie. Ah, I appreciate you being that hundredth like. I feel like I've seen you before. I appreciate you stopping by, my man. Or my lady. I apologize. Lex Luthor. I think Falcon should be an event. Oh, I think he should be too. Um, I didn't even know. Do your clothes Let's get see. like super staticky? I wasn't too I impressed by the hot toy reveals. Um, Dude, I feel you. Well, I'll pull. Like, I think we have one more floor. I'll pull it up after. I, I, I don't have a vision yet, so I figure if I'm gonna get the Wanda, I'm gonna get the vision. Um. So yeah, I have most of the Avengers from the movies. I love this finisher right here. Sorry guys, just bear with me. I'm uh I'm in the heat of battle. The team are no longer 
it's so intense doing these like mega hives where it's like all right if you die you like lose your opportunity to like keep using that character and i know i have four other characters to choose from but i don't know it's cool to play with thor because i he was the first character i got to power 150 on both consoles it was just kind of one of those things favorite avengers game character to play as film guy it is this one right here thor thor is definitely my best one you know um you know, I used All to right, while we're waiting, let's see if we can pull up that hot toy. I met some of your friends. Oh, you mm, they told me tales. To Hold on real quick. Let me just pull up my pre-orders. I, I hope it doesn't show any personal information. Uh, hot toys. Let's see. What do I have? Oh, sign in. The Scarlet Witch one is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, all right, your account, orders, open orders. All right, it doesn't show my address. All right, so we're good there. Um, desktop. All right, so I've pre-ordered the Miles Morales 2020 suit, uh, the Scarlet Witch, the Vision, Ahsoka Tano, Johnny Silverhand, Gambit, and Mysterio. So this is, I love this suit right here, the 2020 so I've got this one pre-ordered. It looks so cool. Um, and I've got this is the Scarlet Witch for um, for Hot Toys. I don't have a Scarlet Witch. They had a limited like one that was a little bit of a more limited version that my friend Greg got, um, where she had more of a comic based suit. And I regret not getting that one, um, but I'm fine now because this one is phenomenal. And then this is the vision we've been talking about. I mean, I think it looks fine. I what was your, I think somebody said they didn't like it. Are hot toys bendable? A little bit. Um, they're kind of like like high quality Barbie dolls, basically. Um, so they are definitely very poseable, and they're very articulated. Um, even like this cape probably has a material in it that you can like bend around and stuff. Um, so yeah, I mean, I don't know. I really like them. So, uh, I, I'm, I'm pretty happy to get him. Uh, Thunder God. Hello, Jay. Long time to speak. We used to talk on Marvel Event Alliance 3. We were both Thorfinn's. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks for, uh, stopping by. Oh, God. Oh, God. They're chasing me. Yeah, I think I have, like, <laughs> I think I'm up to, like, a hundred or more hot toys right now. It's kind of, kind of ridiculous. I mean, listen, that's the best way to describe them for somebody that's never held one, right? It's a high-quality Barbie doll. These enemies must be defeated. <laughs> Hope we see Doctor Strange, yeah. I have a, um, I have a Doctor Strange hot toy, um, from his movie. Um, but yeah, Doctor Strange. Do you, do you think we'll see him in Falcon and Winter Soldier? Is that what you mean? Oh, what am I doing here? Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm looking forward uh, in the game. Oh yeah, Doctor Strange for sure. I'm pretty sure he's in the list. Um, I, that's actually, I think, I think I'm, I'm more excited for the possibility of Scarlet Witch and Doctor Strange than I am most other characters because it will be like a very unique aspect of the game. Like, it'll get into, like, magic wielding and stuff like that. So, yeah, I'm definitely... I think for sure we're going to see Doctor Strange. I think he... Like, when Miller had the the list of characters that he had found in the data mine, I'm pretty sure he was on that list. And I, I would say, like, he's probably one that I'm very excited for, too. I loved using Doctor Strange in uh, Marvel Heroes Omega.
Oh. I'm, I'm pretty sure Vision was on that list. I haven't looked at the list in a while. Um, but there were like 14 or so characters that Miller had like data mined in the game. And I'm pretty sure Vision was on that list. Like I remember War Machine was on there, Falcon was on there, uh, She-Hulk. Wasn't like Quake on there? Tapping in uh, God Angelo Rosa. What's Marvel Heroes Omega? Oh my god. Oh my god. It is one of the greatest video games ever made. That's what it is. Yeah, Quake was on it. Want Quake in the game so bad? Yeah. Now, is that because you're a fan of um, the, the actress? What was her name? Um, Chloe Bennett? Like, I feel like Chloe Bennett and Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. just made her very popular, so... Do you think that they'll ever turn the... No, never. They're gone. Like, people people ask that all the time. Do you ever think Marvel Heroes Omega will come back? It's it's dead. It's buried. All the people that work for the company work for someone what else now. I mean, it's it's pretty crazy. Uh, um, what do I know about Thor the God Butcher? Oh, my God. If you can gain control Thor the God Butcher is why Thor become, became unworthy. Um, Thor the God Butcher is arguably one of um, Thor's biggest foes. Uh, damn well near killed him. Uh, I think Christian Bale is playing him. That's confirmed now, right? I think people are going to think it's crazy. Like, he absolutely wrecks Thor. Like, it's pretty crazy how badly he wrecks him. Um, but basically, um, Gore the God Butcher, as a character, literally is what it says. He kills gods. Like, he is killed, like, he just thirsts for killing gods. He thinks all gods basically ruin worlds. Um, they ruin, like, societies. People put too much faith in gods, and they can never, they never actually care about anything but themselves. Um, um, this is like kind of like a Cliff Notes version of that, but, um, I haven't read that storyline in a little bit, so I'm probably like paraphrasing it wrong. I hate these. Yeah, Chloe did Logan Paul. That's that's questionable enough for you right there. Aim is trying to remove me from their system. Oh my god, why am I running into him? That helps, thank you. I am not doing good on this room. We're basically an ultimate non-believer. Yeah. Like he's the ultimate. He's like the atheist superhero, basically. Well, actually, he's not atheist because he does believe gods exist. He just thinks that they're they're self-serving, and that they are not like they don't deserve their power, basically. Did I see Jacobo's new vid? I did not. Am I supposed to? I mean, my shoes have been going for like two hours, so. I've reached AIM security network. Another one down. When am I gonna play Fortnite? Uh, Friday night. I've been pretty accurate so far. No, he's asking. What do I think about the Young Avengers? They're okay. Not my favorite. So far, the data mines have been very... Yep, exactly. The data mines have been, like, literally, like, perfect. Like, uh, the guy that usually is known for doing the data mines, Miller, 
Like, I trust anything he says, basically. Like, if he says it's in there, it's there. Excellent work. You've dealt another blow to aim. You're not finished Ooh. yet. Oh, Madman's there. Why is... Dude, I missed Madman's comment. Ugh. Scroll Girl sucks. Don't get me going, bro. I like this, uh... This one that I have on right now. I really like this one for some reason. What emote do I have on now? All right, let's change up. Uh, let's put on this one. Elgato light strips are lit. They are, right? Oh, let's change up the colors. I like this kind of teal color. What if Winter Soldier was... Uh, Winter Soldier should be in the game. I believe he was on the list as well. All right. Whew, so we have to do eight Mega Hives, guys. That's that's part of this whole thing. What's the original skin of that recolor called? Um, hold on. This is Gauntlet 5 of 8. Uh, hold on one sec. I'll go back to it. So we're at the halfway point. It took us almost two hours to get there. I know I've done a lot of, like, messing around. All right, so... So this is Lightbreaker. This is the Verizon skin. Um, so you had to get this skin from Verizon. Um, obviously, it's a recolor. Obsidian's a recolor. Uh, Ingot is a recolor. Tungsten's a recolor. Cobalt. I think the Iconic. It's a recolor of the Iconic suit. Um, but what's wrong with Scroll Girl? What's not wrong with Scroll Girl? Scroll Girl's freaking awful. Uh, give me one second, guys. I need to, like, just stand up and walk around uh, the room for, like, two minutes. Not even two minutes. I'm across the room right now. I probably sound awful because I'm nowhere near the mic. I just need to get up and stretch real quick. It's very important to get up and stretch every once in a while, especially when you're as old as me, which is like dirt. But anyway, you know what? I'm going to change hats too. I have a set change. So we can wear this this one a little bit. No, I just, I just wanted to stretch for a second. Try to break in this atrocitous hat. Red lantern hat. It's happening, Dylan. Really wish the cloning labs was dropped by now. I know, man. There's definitely a lot of stuff that um, I, I definitely wish had dropped. Um, send me something on Discord. Let me let me look real quick. Be careful out there. We're all counting on you. Oh, nice. Hold on. Let's just. Uh... So if you're not on the Discord, by the way. You should be. Head for the location on your um, desktop. So this is what Nina was uh, was showing. Some of her uh, these are these are dope. Some of her in-game like uh, screen grabs. I love this suit. Yeah, these are cool. So. All right, let me uh, put this back on my other screen real quick. And boom. <laughs> 10, 10 Discord server. Tap it in, Chase. These enemies must be defeated. So Squirrel Girl is like a meme to me, okay? Like, I kind of feel like, I think in a lot of ways, it just kind of was a, a thing that took on a life of its own. Like, everybody was always like, you know, I don't know. Just the people that liked Squirrel Girl were always like, so mad that I didn't. But I just think she's a dumb character. I think she's vastly overrated. 
Um, I don't understand why people like try to take her so seriously. I think if, if people didn't take her so seriously, I would probably have less of a problem with her. But like, essentially, at her best, she's Jessica Jones and Luke Cage's babysitter. At her worst, I mean, she's just terrible. But like, that's the best you should expect from Squirrel Girl. I really don't understand. I've never advocated for like PETA, like, um, you know, trying to, to shut anybody or anything down. But I will like join PETA in protest of Squirrel Girl outside of Marvel headquarters in New York City, which by the way, is only about a four hour drive for me. I've been there before, like not in it, but just buy it. Dude, um, Superior Chris, you do realize I did an April Fool's video uh, that they were making Lego Squirrel Girl, right? The enemies have been defeated. So yeah, I, I, I oh, I didn't realize I didn't put my uh, cam link back on. Sorry, I know you guys love looking at me. Peter vs. I know I will advocate for Peter vs. Squirrel Girl. So that's not canon. She did not beat Thanos or. Modok, not canon. That you have to complete setup. Yeah, so on, on Discord, you have to accept the rules. Um, so if you go into Why don't you wear the helmet anymore? Um, rules and social media, uh, you just have to accept the rules there. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. All right, 109 likes. Thank you, guys. We're only on floor 105, really? We shall prevail. Oh, 200 likes? That would be a dream come true. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Well, that's the thing. Squirrel Girl was a member of the Great Lakes of Avengers who were, as a group, like an absolute joke. They were intended to be a joke. But everybody took them so, like, well, at least Squirrel Girl anyway. They just took her so seriously, and I never understood it. Like, they had, like, Big Bertha... Um, they had the guy, um, well like, uh, what, what was his name? Um, like Eternal Man or something like that, where basically he died and would just come back to life. Like, that was his power. He would die and come back to life. Like, Immortal Man, I think it was. All right, thank you for stopping by, Cream Cheese. I think it's cool that Unbox Junkies was watching us. You never know who's watching, folks. You never know. I I like to lurk. Like, when I watch people that are live, I usually try to just lurk. Like, I don't like to draw attention to myself. Like, I, I sometimes, like, especially on, like, Saturday when Blitzwinger is doing his custom matches, um, I will... I'll just sit there while I'm having lunch or something and just watch you guys play and everything. And I try not to say anything because, like, you know, as soon as I say something, everybody's like, oh, Jay Shockblast is here. And I just don't like taking away from, like, Blitz's stream. Not that, like, I think anybody else is really doing that, but I don't know. It's just, it's a me thing more than anything. I feel weird about it. Who is the best Marvel, in my opinion? Marvel heart. character? Well, my favorite is like a three-way tie between Nova, Thor, and Deadpool. These must be defeated. Um, so, I mean, I don't know that they're necessarily the best. Like, if we're talking like most powerful. I don't know. Actually, Thor with... Um, Thor with the... Uh, 
the herald powers was pretty powerful. Come on, I waited too long. I have a sneeze coming on. But yeah, those are my three favorite characters. I mean, I think, you know, obviously when you talk about like most powerful characters in the Marvel Universe, you know, you start talking about those Omega level threats. You got to consider like the Phoenix um, or Jean Grey with the Phoenix powers. You know, you got to think about, um, you know, I think Hulk really deserves to be in that like equation. Oh god, 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 I'm in trouble. Give me health, give me health. Why does every Wanda stand think she can fight everyone? The enemies have been defeated. Um, so I think Wanda is definitely one of the most powerful characters, especially if you consider, um, What's the storyline? Where she goes, no more mutants, and basically snaps away all the mutants. Um, why can't I think of it? You guys know what I'm talking about. Um, but, you know, she basically... Uh, yeah, House of M. Thank you, thank you, uh, Sanaju Sign. Appreciate that. Uh, sometimes I just blank, guys. I just... But House of M... Like, if you read House of M... You understand just how powerful Wanda is. And I think she has all of that in her now in the MCU. You know what? I don't even like these ones. I'm just going to get rid of them. I think she has all of that now in the out MCU. But they just, they're just they they're slowly unlocking that. And I think that um, the, the Doctor Strange movie is going to, uh, to basically kind of pull that out of her completely. All right, so we are close. Um, but yeah, the official University of Virginia account was in Blitzwinger's chat before. That's funny. Xbox was in my my chat before. Um, yeah, it is old age. Chase, were you here when I was showing off all the hats? Did you see the Nova hat yet? Right now, she's the most powerful. I don't know about that. I mean, well, I guess Thanos is dead. Is Superior Iron Man going to... No, it's Thursday. You did not see the Nova hat? I want a rematch. Dude, give it up. We're just better than you. Nonsense. If I hadn't driven off that rainbow bridge, I would surely have defeated you before. An elite aim team is close by... How sick is that? Updating your HUD. So I finally pulled the trigger on that one. I actually saw it for the first time at New York Comic Con in 2017. And I almost bought it then. But it was like $70 at the show. And I I want I just I know I'm not probably not even going to wear it. I think the twins are trapped in the dream realm. Yeah. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Is 
Darkhawk? Uh, do you hear about Zoomer X-Men? No, I don't know what you mean about that. Uh, Rex, I saw that Darkhawk thing, but that, that article is from November. But I don't I don't believe anything until I see it. I don't know why they would do a Darkhawk series, to be honest with you. Uh, they are bringing him back. Like, he is getting his own comic and everything. Uh, Marvel's Capcom for 10 bucks. Um, I think it's pretty good. I think it's worth 10 bucks. I mean, you can get through the story. The story is interesting. I mean, I played it. Head for the location on um, your heart. When they fell asleep, I believe their consciousness and souls are in the nightmare dimension. We are not alone. Well, I mean, that is the like the after credit scene, right? Nearby and needs your help. Look for a chest with like we do nearby. kind of uh, hear that. Oh god! Oh god! So we know they still exist, right? You know, that part is clear. Um, you know, I'm sure we're gonna see them again. I'm sure there's gonna be like, that's gonna be part of the whole story, you know? So I'm interested to see where they go with it. Is Raw vs. Capcom any good? I mean, it's okay. You will have to play some, uh, some of the Capcom These characters. Must be defeated. This is like one of my least favorite rooms. <laughs> Sorry about your damn luck, boy. A whole walkthrough of Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite on the channel. So yeah, I played it when it came out. I think I actually have a video or two that have like tons of views for that game. Just kind of crazy. Yo, what's up, Mo Ethical? I wish Thor had more attacks without his hammer in this game. Maybe. I don't usually use him that much without his hammer, though. Bully this guy. The enemies have been uh, defeated. Jay the bully. I I will definitely tell everybody that Beck. Uh, everybody, I will definitely tell Becky that everybody said happy birthday, but specifically you, Chase. 
Would you be in the revisit Deadpool for a stream? Um, yeah. Yeah, I could do that. What's the first video I uploaded to YouTube? Um, it was for Battlefield Bad Company 2. Uh, that's the reason I, I started making videos. Guess what you guess got today? You What'd you get? All the time. Yeah. You don't think Bucky Just will keep, keep the shield at the end and become like Captain America? I don't know. I feel like we're heading for a twist. Team I believe Eric, America Chavez. Well. Yeah, they're, they're saying that uh, she will be. I even wasted my time fighting them. Thanks, Kamala. We are not alone. Uh, I got the legendary Gibby skin in Apex. Nice. What are your thoughts on the free play version Marvel on PlayStation? Dude, who has PlayStation now? Do you know Every a single person a that has PlayStation now? Because I don't. I've never. I don't know a single person with PlayStation now. Everybody's making like this this big deal about it, and I don't understand because like like I don't know a single person that uses PlayStation now. I mean, good for them, I guess. Whatever they can do to get people that want to care about the game, I'm I'm all for. One of their agents is down. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. Oh. Samsung S5 um, is it good to charge your phone to 100? I think so. I mean, I try to keep my phone as charged as possible. What is Pac-Man 99? Isn't that like the kind of like the version like their their version of the tetris like um like isn't there like a tetris battle royale and is it pac-man 99 that basically i don't i don't even understand that joke Blitzwinger is more like Blitzwinger? I don't understand. I got 7 day travel PS now for Lego Batman 3 and that's it. Apparently 2 million PlayStation players use PlayStation now. 2 million? How many people do you think has Game Pass? I would venture to say Game Pass has like... 25 million? 30 million? Maybe more? Try to 100% damage your battery. So... Every battery has like a certain amount of like charge charges. So I don't know how to explain it. Like, so you can only like deplete the battery a certain amount of times. Excellent work. You've dealt another blow to aim. You're PlayStation Now yet. is you are and also like I'm not an expert on PlayStation Now, but aren't you only streaming the game? You're not like actually downloading it. It's kind of like Netflix in that way. Uh, I feel like they should shut down the... I mean, they're... Like, honestly, we got PS5 now. Like, PS3 servers probably should go down, you know? Dude, we'll see you later, Kenny. Thanks for being here. And then Mario 35 and now Pac-Man 99. All right, let me just uh, take a quick peek here. Actually, you know what? We're, we're through five levels of the hive now, or the mega hive. Uh, so I think it's time for a pee break. So what do we got here? This is 
Heroic Six. I think I've been doing these on two. Oh my god. I think I've been doing all these on like challenge two. Which is fine. I just I'm just trying to like get my way through it, you know? Um but hold on, let me just check on the Red Sox score real quick. A three three. Bruins win four two. Celtics lose. Bergeron, Bergeron, Marshawn, Bergeron. Hat trick for Bergeron. Love it. Alright. So don't let anybody leave, guys. I got to go uh, take a quick old man pee break. Uh, I'll be right back. Uh, we'll see you later, Breezy. Thanks for stopping by. Um, so one moment. I'll let you listen to some music before I go. Uh, actually, hold on. Let me uh, get that DJ Chrome up. I'll be right back, guys. I gave you some tunes, right? All right. Whew. It should have been PS Plus, yeah, <laughs> right? Be careful out there. We're all counting on you. Um, should I replay the campaign in Marvel? I mean, if you want to. I mean, uh, what song was that? That's my boy DJ Chrome. Uh, hold on. Let me get your. I'll An put a link to his Spotify. Updating your HUD. Let me put a link to his Spotify and chat. Uh, so that is my boy DJ Chrome. He is awesome. One of my bestest friends ever. Um, so should have ended up in chat, right? All right, there's a the link. Okay, yeah. All right, let's uh, put a new costume on. Let's go back to this one. Love this one. Um, anyway, I feel like Lego Star Saga haven't even made for No, they they already said it's delayed. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Damn it! Another agent. 
Oh my god. I have absolutely been playing this whole time on uh, challenge two. I can already tell the difference. What game is like eight years old? Uh, what's happening, Nathan? Uh, I'm excited for the MCU skins. I'm honestly excited for anything they do that's new in this game. You know, I just love the game. I love playing it. So, really, if they're going to do anything, I'm going to be hyped for it. Um, can you please make videos about how to make an Invincible in DC Supervillains? Um, I can look into it. The team are no longer a threat. <laughs> I still gotta watch that on uh, Amazon Prime. Dude, it's so hard to get a PS5. I actually got like a shell, so I'll be able to like make my PS5 red soon. Um, and Aiden, I like hope you got the, the name of that song, or the, the link for it. What's happening, Cozy Bedtime Stories? Head for the location on your HUD. Oh god. happening Cameron uh, or 80% okay um, almost complete the Guardians quest nice uh, I wish the game had open world I mean some of the levels are big enough to feel open world they're not like a perfect open world um, but like there are some levels that, that feel like they are they are working on a patrol zone um, in the wastelands so there will be something that feels like must be what we would get out of like midtown manhattan uh when we played marvel heroes omega i can't believe i was playing on challenge two the whole time like i i'm obviously good enough to do it but like i don't really like the stress of playing it that way Especially this mode. Like, in this mode, there's no incentive. I just want to, um... All I really want to do in this game is, uh... Or in this game mode is get through it and do it, you know? Man. What exotic do I want? I, I'm gonna try to get the exotic for Clint. I don't know exactly which one I want. I, I really don't care to be honest with you. I just hope I get a good one. I'm basically for the eighth level, I'm gonna switch to, uh, to Clint. And, and I just, I don't even really care. I. I don't know enough about them all, but I don't have any, I've never, I honestly only have like a few exotic, like three or four exotics ever anyway, because I don't really do the Mega Hives, usually. I didn't, Thor is OP, you're right, Epiczilla. 
Um, the chess piece is Clint's only good one. Oh. Would you rather be a YouTuber or be president? Um, I don't want anything to do with being president, man. I feel like there's no incentive to being president other than, like, I don't know, the, the income. I wouldn't want anything to do with that because I just feel like there's no... I don't know. I try not to get too political. I really don't think it matters. I think uh, everything with politics is, you know, the people that agree with you are only going to care. And the people that don't are not going to care. And it's just like, there's no in between. Here's more arrows in a bag of tricks. Oh, gotcha. Yo, what's up, XHPK? I'm not going for Thor's exotic. I'm going to uh, switch it to Clint after. I'm basically do, taking a page out of your book. To you taught me well, uh, XHBK. You cannot let them. I watched you basically use the main character you want for the first seven floors, and then uh, switch to who you wanted the gear for after. Although I probably should try to get a Thor exotic piece. I just don't use them as much anymore. Because I already have them like so highly leveled. Love it when I attack my teammates. Beginning infiltration. The shutdown protocol is progressing. Uh, I tried to get the PS Plus skin for Hawkeye, but it um. It didn't seem to give it to me. Is there a fix for that? Like, it gave me the 616 skin. Do I have to wait to unlock the 616 skin in, um... Security system. Got your first exotic ever yesterday? Nice. The shutdown protocol is progressing. Uh I actually got it in my email from PlayStation today too. Yeah, it's this one right here. Like it says I purchased it, but it gave me the 616 skin instead of the 1610. So, I don't really know what's up with that. Like, I don't know if there's, like, if they fixed it or not. I don't think there's a fix yet for people who redeemed it before they fixed it. Oh. I got it, but they haven't played. I gotcha. I'm really shocked that they, um, they messed up so badly with the two maestro uh, villain sectors. I feel like whatever they did in the last update, like, just messed up everything with the, uh, the missions. Like, I feel like missions just disappear forever. Like, you do a mission, and then it's just gone. Uh, do I have the Black Panther suit? Um, I don't know what you mean, Cameron. Updating your HUD. I don't feel like I claimed it right away, though. The some old classic bug stuck in the next gen that existed. Oh. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Typical.
Like, how, how does he, like, not, like... I don't know, whatever. Oh god. Bring me the Whiffed on that. I love this is my favorite takedown. I don't know why, I just love that takedown. The team are no longer a threat. Uh, the new one that just came out for Black Panther? Like, you mean this? That's just, that was just a screenshot. Is it, is it weird after a while? I don't know. Do you know TV's been around for 93 years? Seems like it. Yo, HBK, were you here when I was showing off my sick new hat? Dude, look at this. Look at this. Hey, so is there like, I don't know, a ton of fanfiction? Pretty dope, about right? Me? Some, yeah. Uh, just some. Look at on your heart. Iconic Black Panther. Look for a chest with gear nearby. I'm like never gonna wear it. It's basically gonna be like on display all the time. On that. Who did I mean before Kate? Um, I Thor has always been my main character, um, and then it was kind of Hawkeye. Uh, not Hawkeye, uh, Captain America. But now that the two Hawkeyes are out, I really love both of them. Uh, I miss Cat Chadwick. Yeah, I, I'm really like Chadwick Boseman is such a great actor. It's really sad that you know, he's gone. I don't really know why I'm doing this. I don't really care. was Iron Man. I'm I am the worst at Iron Man. Like he's honestly my worst character. I'm glad people like like him. I'm just so bad at him. Oh, I hope they I hope they absolutely recast him. I mean, you can't tell me Chadwick Boseman would want Black Panther to die with him. Like absolutely not. Find another great actor to, to fill those shoes. That's absolutely what he would want. I refuse to believe that he would just want, like... Yeah, I just don't believe it. Uh, Hawkeye or Cap, most fun. I think Black Panther's gonna be a lot of fun. You know, I don't even need this. I don't care. 
let's just get out of here, guys. Like, I got a piece of blue gear out of the other one. Whatever, I don't need this. Yo, I Revers X. Hey, man, haven't been in the streams in a while. Hope you remember me. Yeah, man. Welcome back. Thank you. About to get Nova. These right enemies here. must be defeated. I appreciate that, man. Thanks for stopping by. Wait, I love when Nova pops up on the screen. There he is. Yeah, thank you though. I, I appreciate that. Welcome back. You know, I, I think it's been awesome. One of the things I've really loved about streaming Avengers a lot since uh, Hawkeye came out um, is just like all the people that have been coming back and saying, oh man, I, I loved watching you during Marvel Heroes and, and stuff like that. Like that means so much to me. And, and like, I understand how YouTube works. It's weird. Like people just like disappear from your feed and all sorts of stuff like that. You know, I'm not always going to, like, post videos about games that everybody loves. And I get it, man. Like, it's cool. I just appreciate any time that anybody wants to give me, you know? I think you have to remove the emotion from Chadwick Boseman being gone. You know what I mean? Like, I know that it's like, how do you do that? But, like, it's one of those things where... Like, the role... Like, the show must go on. And I think, you know, if anybody would have known that, it would have been Chadwick Boseman. And if you think that he... Did it go slow mode? I don't know. You hyped for the Spider-Man DLC? Nice. But, like, think about it. Like, he fought to keep playing these roles through cancer, you know? And he knew what his work meant for other black actors, you know? And I think that's why he fought so hard and and he basically did all that to make sure that like others that followed him had those opportunities. And when it comes to comic books and, you know, black comic book characters, I don't think there's anyone more iconic than Black Panther. So how do you shelve him, you know? Like, I don't, I just don't believe that Chadwick Boseman would actually want that, you know? I feel like he did so much to make sure that all of these movies mattered to all the people that looked like him to, like, to want that to go. And do you really trust, like, I mean, look, I know Shuri becomes Black Panther in the comics, okay? But Bast rejects her, right? Like, Bass doesn't even want her to be Black Panther. It was done out of, like, more necessity than anything. And I, I just... I don't think people really want that story. Like, I like Letitia Wright. I thought she... I think she's good as Shuri, and I'm, I'm okay with all that. And I'm okay with, like, her... Shuri becoming Black Panther as part of the story. Just not forever. Because I feel like they were going that direction anyway. Because if you watch Endgame, um, Okoye so talks low. about there being um, earthquakes in the ocean, right? Um, so she talks about you know earthquakes in the ocean, and that is basically a reference to Namor. You know, you know they're basically setting up you know that aspect of Black Panther where where he actually does die and goes down to Necropolis and sure he does become Black Panther. That's all part of that story. So they were already kind of halfway there, but I think in a perfect world, uh, you have Michael B. Jordan just take over as T'Challa and we just all suspend our disbelief a little bit and pretend, you know, and just, just deal with it. You know, what's up in Bray Bray? You're rich, Cameron? Nice. I am not. So that's that's the way that I feel. When does the Spider-Man DLC come out? Um, we don't know for sure, but probably in the fall. You know, we're probably looking at, like, 
Um, oh god, I need health, I need health. Where's health? Oh, was I getting health in there? I mean, it's gonna be after Black Panther, so... I heard they're gonna kill off Black Panther off-screen. And that's fine, but they have to bring him back at some point. Like, he can't just be dead. You can't just have Black Panther gone. Like, I'm sorry, it just does not work. Like, T'Challa has to be Black Panther. Another enemy defeated. And don't you think that Chadwick Boseman would want Michael B. Jordan, like his good friend, to just take over? And we could just... just, just we, we, we literally watched um, Don Cheadle become War Machine and didn't bat an eyelash. Why can't we do that for Black Panther, you know? Like, Terrence Howard was War Machine and fairly prominently featured in the movie. And then all of a sudden, you know... Boom. Out of nowhere, Don Cheadle is War Machine. So, like, if we can do that for War Machine, why can't we do it? Like, I get it. It's sad that he died, but, like, excellent work. lots of people get replaced because of death. You're it sucks. Yet. But it's... Uh, favorite Donny Cates run in comics? Definitely Thor. Yeah, Epiczilla. I just... It's unfortunate that it happened. It definitely puts a wrench in things. But I think the the better thing to do would be just to hold off, push it back a little bit. You looked it up and I have good money? <laughs> I don't know what you're looking at. Yeah, exactly. He he definitely was the, the face of the, you know, people of color Marvel for sure. And that definitely makes it harder. But, you know, they're like, I feel like... Y he would not want that to die with him, you know? Like, I feel like you got to find the next person. He would want to elevate someone else into that role. That's what I truly believe. And I, I mean, like, no one will ever change my mind on that. Like, I just believe that with, like, all my heart and soul. And I mean, why wouldn't people want to? Like, I mean, it's crazy. Like, Letitia Wright like went on some serious anti-vaxxer stuff like she's a little bit of a loose cannon in that regard you know he would argue why they have exactly madman exactly like why haven't you already but like i feel like just push it back a little bit and let everybody go through their time of mourning and then eventually you know you have that opportunity to go back to it Yours was Guardians. Yeah, Guardians was good, too. Whew. All right. This is the longest quest ever. Um, all right. Which Thor skin do we want to go to now? Let's just do regular construction guy. Regular construction guy Thor. So, I, I just... I don't know. Not that there's anything wrong with... Like, I, I, I don't really want to get into that aspect of things, but... You know, I just don't know that, like... Yeah, like, why would there ever... N you can never have T'Challa again because Chadwick Boseman died. Come on. We've had, like, three Jokers since Heath Ledger died. Thing is that Chadwick Seth was... Yeah, it was a shock. It was a shock. Be careful out that's there. absolutely We're correct. On you. And that's the part that I think is hard for everybody to accept because it came out of nowhere. It was such a shock. And it's kind of like Kobe, you know? Like, everybody's like, oh, well, Kobe should be the logo Head for the NBA now. Your heart. You know? It's like well-intentioned. Like, people have well... I think this is just the the, the reality of today's, today's society in general. Oh, defeat all the targets. Um, like, people have well-intentioned ideas, and they take on a life of their own, you know? And... Yo... Thank you so much, I Revers. R.I.P. Chadwick Boseman, for sure. Agreed completely. Um, look at that. Look at that, right there, Nova. Dude, thank you so much, I appreciate that. But that, that I think that's part of the problem. Like, not, not a problem. Like, everybody has, like, well intentions and everything, but you know, 
Heath Ledger died and it was a shock. And I know it's not totally the same, but like all of a sudden we had another Joker, right? You know, we've had multiple Jokers sent him. I, I mean, I feel it. I understand it. But I just feel like you kind of want to keep the keep that everybody moving forward, right? I, I appreciate that, iRevs. Can't find you knew about Tyrus Cancer. Yeah. I mean I don't I don't think it's up to Chadwick though. You know? Why I don't really think like I think it's good to get his opinion. But at the end of the day, like, you know, like Roberto Clemente died tragically in a, a plane crash. You know, they didn't cancel baseball forever. You know, the Pirates eventually got a new outfielder. I mean, I know that these are like not completely the same scenarios, but Heath Joker is one of the greatest villains. Yeah, he was, he got two into the role, right? I, I think his Joker took away from uh, the Two Face from uh, Philip Seymour Hoffman because I think his uh, Two Face was absolutely amazing too. I don't know what they will do with Black Panther Two because Chadwick stuff. Yeah, I think I think they explore the other aspects of Wakanda through that Wakanda Forever show. But they aren't going to CGI him. Well, I mean, theoretically, anybody can be under the mask. All he has to do is die under the mask, and you don't. It, it doesn't matter who he is, right? You just don't see his face. Okay. You'll say Heath Ledger was depressed. Yeah, Aaron Eckhart. You're right, Aaron Eckhart. It was not Philip Seymour Hoffman. I don't know why I blanked there. Yeah, Aaron Eckhart was fantastic as Two Face, and people kind of forget that, right? Yeah, exactly, uh, I Revers. Um, so that's that's the big rumor is that like he got so into the role that it just messed with him, you know? And when you're already like battling depression to like to go into such a dark place, it's gotta be like hard, you know? have these conversations and stuff and like everybody's like just respectful because I feel like there's definitely like you know people that have disagreeing thoughts on the the idea that are a little more passionate about it oh no I messed that up this is my least favorite adaptoid right here oh god get back get back get back Love this unpopular opinion, right? He was murdered. Uh, I mean, that that is another one of those uh, thoughts that are out there. And there's a big cover up behind it. Yeah, the Olsons. One of the Olsons did it, right? I just feel like it would be dis It's not disrespectful though. Oh, oh, wait, no. I mean. Yeah, no, I get what you're saying, but like I think that was gonna happen anyway. Like that's the thing, I think that he was going to die in some way, no matter what, because they were gonna they were teasing, um, 
Atlas, uh, so I, uh, Atlantis versus Wakanda. Uh, so, like, Namor is one of <laughs> Black Panther's awesome. big rivals. They absolutely hate each other, right? So I think they were kind of teasing Namor uh, invading Wakanda, which happens in the comics. And through that, Name, uh, Black Panther actually dies and, and goes to Necropolis. And that's when Shuri has to become Black Panther. So, like, I think they were already going that direction naturally, you know? No, he knew some things. Oh, I got you. They will throw everything at you to keep their servers intact. Destroy them all. All right, I already hate using this skin. Um, I love this one. It's red. Tap it, Ash Freeman. What do I think Donny Cates will do next? So he just said that what he's doing, what he's working on next, is crazy. And somebody asked him if it was Moon Knight, and he very purposely like s said no but made it sound like no actually means yes. So I, I'm wondering if it's Moon Knight. And I think, like, I think of all the times that Marvel has tried to make Moon Knight, like, a big thing, a main thing, and they just got done having him featured in Avengers, um, Earth's Mightiest Heroes, like, pretty prominently. So there's a whole run where they were, like, essentially fighting Khonshu. Um, so I think Donny Cates is just, like, the main event of Marvel right now. He's like the best they have as a writer. So why wouldn't you want to put him on, on Moon Knight, right? The server is down. Yeah, there are definitely a lot of, of recolors. So I don't know for sure if it is going to... Oh, God. I don't know for sure if it's going to be Moon Knight, but I sure as heck would like that. I, it's not confirmed, though. It's not confirmed that it's Moon Knight. Um, but we'll see. Wow, as we're talking about Moon Knight, my brother walks in the room. It's almost like the signal went up. Yeah, I feel Moon Knight can never really pull off good main character. Yeah. I, I think they've done a lot with him recently, and if Donny Cates is really gonna do Moon Knight, I think that's just like some next level stuff they're gonna they're gonna have for him. And especially with him getting a new show and Oscar Isaac gonna be the star of it, it's gonna be very important to like make him, you know, a prominent character. Or I'm gonna talk offline about the Ledger thing. Yeah, I got you. I, I've definitely heard stuff like that before, kind of like a Anthony Bourdain, Chester Bennington kind of thing. Like, there's lots of rumors. Um, who is the other? The Soundgarden guy, Chris Cornell. There's all those rumors around all of those guys. I didn't so realize Ledger was kind of on that, too. My brother Loki is a giant, though I'm rather small. You went to the exercise center? Nice. It has a location on your heart. You shall take them down! These huh. must be Did you hear? Did you hear that aim person be like, "It's Thor"? Uh, Epstein stuff, yeah. Get bullied, bro. Get bullied. All right, they bullied me.
next Avengers movie back. I mean, it's probably gonna be a while. I don't know when the date is, but it ain't gonna be anytime soon. Oh, wow. Kate, what is going on with you, lady? I feel like I just bounced Mjolnir off Kate's head the there. Have been defeated. Do you think Toby the Toes McGuire and Andrew the Cat Garfield are actually going to... Yes. Yeah, they're going to be in Spider-Man. Like, that much is... Like, they're they're just messing around with people, like, trying to claim he's not. He is def... They're, both of them are definitely in the, the next Spider-Man movie. For sure. Okay. What'd you say? Okay. Okay. Let me not use that word while I'm live streaming. An elite aim team is close by and on a Next reboot will have Tom the other cat, right? What I don't know what that means. There's a chest with gear close by. One of our shield allies nearby could use some help. I think Johnny Cates will write a good Shang Chi run. Nah, they just restarted Shang Chi. I doubted Shang Chi. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. I can't believe, like, I tagged you so that you could see the Shang Chi pops. And you're like, what? I'm like, what do you mean, what? Look at the picture. What's happening, uh, Saviosaurus? Uh, I do think those rumors are true. Oh god, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. need health. Oh, no, I'm fine, actually. Okay, get back, get back, get back. Why is that thing's range so big? Yeah, they, they got the rights back to basically, I think, everybody uh, from Netflix. So I think we're going to see everybody. You're at school. I got you. I got you, but I don't got you. First of all, why are you on Discord at school, bro? I wish there was a free roam. So, some of the, it's not like a traditional free roam, but some of the missions do have free roam aspects to them. Um, they are also working on... What are they working on? They're working on like a patrol zone in the, uh, the, the new area. It just wasn't quite ready yet. That's what I heard, but after Tom... Yeah, but Tom Holland's just messing with everybody, you know? I mean, I know it's not like your traditional Midtown Manhattan, but... <laughs> oh, it's because I tagged you. You're like, oh my god, Jay Shockblast tagged me. I gotta look right now. Because <laughs> I don't do that. I, I very rarely tag you. So I get it. Oh my god, I should have definitely flown by him. John Bernthal of the MC. I hope so. I hope they keep him as Punisher. I'm wondering how they're going to handle him as a character, though. Because that was pretty brutal. It would be great. I thought John, John Bernthal was fantastic enemies must be defeated. as Punisher.
is Godspeed fast or the Flash? I mean, Godspeed is fast. I don't know. I don't know the ins and outs of the the speed force to know who is. I thought they said Wally West was the fastest. And isn't he like giving that back or something? I don't know. If they do show Daredevil and MCU, yeah, I, I really agree with you. They really do need to get. If they can get basically, um, I would be fine with them bringing Finn Jones back too, to be honest with you. But if they did replace him, like recast him, I'd be okay with it. Uh, but they really should do their best to get all those Netflix actors back. I know it's gonna be hard. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Don't die, don't die now, don't die now. I know it's gonna be hard though because some of them are in other shows. Um, like, I don't know if you guys know, but um, Simone Missick, I think her name is, who played Misty Knight, uh, she has her own show in uh, All Rise where she's like a judge. And the guy that played um, Bullseye is on that show too. He's like her friend and he's a lawyer. So like, I don't know how they're gonna get either of them back. But you know, like that's the, the one challenge they might run into is that some people have just moved on to other products, uh, projects. If Lego Marvel 3 ever comes out, I'm emailing it. TT Games are going to try to push. I bet Shang-Chi is going to be in the next game no matter what. Like, it just makes sense. He's going to have a movie by then, you know? Who's my favorite Spider-Man out of... Uh, definitely Tom Holland. I think Tom Holland's... Not only is he the best Spider-Man, but he's the best Peter Parker. And then the guy that played Luke Cage. Yeah, he's in another show. Yeah. Excellent work. You've dealt another blow to aim. You're not finished Ooh, yet. All right, last one. What's up, Gaming Pizza? All right, so we got one more to go. Let's go back to classic. All right. Kristen Ritter, yeah. I thought she was great as Jessica Jones, for sure. You think Ben Affleck's Daredevil will come? No. <laughs> I mean, I guess he could in that uh, in one of those multiverse movies. That would be a funny Easter egg. I haven't really thought of that. Plays the eight? Nah, I don't. I I want to play as this. Actually, you know what? I'm switching off Thor now. Anyway. Uh, no, nah, I'm good with that. Because I want to do the last zone as uh, Clint. Try to get a, a good gear piece for him. That would actually be, I, you know what? That's a good thought. I've never thought of that. Maybe but Affleck has been. No, he's, Batman's off, or uh, Affleck's off Batman, isn't he? All right, so we're almost there. 16 more points. We'll finish off his challenge card. I can't believe I didn't finish this already. All right, let's switch to uh, Clint. I have him at power 145 now. Ten drop zones. Reach. Combo three hits or greater against an enemy after dodging. All right. I could probably do those, like, just without trying. All right. Let's uh, go iron eye for him. Gear. Enough. I need a good arrow here to get him powered back up. Alright. Alright, guys, this is the last one. So we've got we've done seven out of the eight. Oh, my back is killing me. Uh so here we are. Heroic gauntlet number eight. Uh 
All right, let's get through this. Apparently, Dare that Dare yeah that Daredevil movie was not that good. He's getting a solo movie on HBO Max. When did that happen? You got the gold variant? Yeah, I, I haven't finished his challenge card yet. Uh, so this might be the last uh, run. We are now Because the this territory. is the last last stage forces. of the Mega Hive. You so site. I should hopefully get my exotic piece out of this. On your yeah, I thought Affleck like was confirmed done with uh with Have Batman. Location on your heart. Oh god. It's gonna take me a minute to like remember that I'm not playing as Thor anymore. These enemies must I just be literally played for like three and a half hours a certain way, or three hours a certain way, and now, now I gotta remember how to play as someone else. I love Clint so much, he's so good. You hate the Jarvis Barry visuals? I don't I don't actually uh, disagree with you on that. I don't have I haven't really had many um many <laughs> Was it from we got this covered? We all I mean I think we all know what that means, right? <laughs> Cause nothing they say is real. Shun off. <laughs> Show enough dick slap. <laughs> hey, just got the game recently and I just unlocked Black Widow in story mode. Any tips on leveling her? Um, I feel as though the best way to level the characters is once you've unlocked hives, just run hives. Because if you're trying to get all the trophies or achievements, um, you're going to want to do them anyway. You have to do 50. So the best way to level characters is just to go do hives like rinse, lather, repeat, or lather, rinse, repeat, basically. Um, yeah, Rex Road said it, you know, just hive, hive, hive. Uh, what's up, Jake Kong? Do you think they will get X-Men in this game? Hopefully. Um, you know, I was thinking maybe Professor X would be in this game. Um, and his superpower would be like, his wheelchairs, tires, would like, will like uncap and turn into speakers, and he would just like jam some like, uh, he would like rickroll them from his like uh, wheelchair basically. So yeah, hopefully that's what we get. Although I would have to turn off music in the game at that point, because I don't want to get demonetized. Can always count on you, Jay Kong. Wolverine at most, I think. Maybe Rogue. Destroy lucky. the turbine. But Rogue and Rogue and Captain Marvel hate each other, though. Um, I mean, when I think of Avengers that hey, have been X Men, I think of obviously you. Wolverine. I think of um, hey, no I'll get to I think of Havoc. Uh, Beast. But I don't think they're gonna. I mean, obviously, it's Deadpool. I 
All right, thanks, Iris. Dude, thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate the, uh, the love that you showed. I mean, honestly, it's crazy. Thank you. I hope everybody, I hope you had a good time, enjoyed. Hope I answered all your questions. This is my least favorite Daphoid. Spider-Man from YouTube. Can anyone tell me if this game is hard? Um, I mean, it's not too hard. It can be hard. Oh, God. How did he get that much back? Oh, my God. Like, it's not that hard. Like, honestly, um, it, there is a little bit of a learning curve at first, but I think the combat is real good. What's happened to Samuel Ramos? If Wolverine were in the game... What would his range attack be? I just don't think he would have one. I don't really know how he would really do a range attack for him. He would summon Colossus that would, like, do a fastball special. That would be his range attack. What's happening, MC, uh, Marvel DC Star Wars fan? got this covered yeah yeah first of all if you're not aware guys we got this covered not the most reliable source so if you see news and it's from there always take it with a grain of salt give him a special from the old arcade game for range yeah he just all of a sudden colossus rolls in and he's like later That would be a pretty cool ultimate. Predictable, but cool. How did Thor go down? Fast while so much I hate this adaptoid. That I mean like of all the adaptoids, it is definitely the, the douchiest adaptoid. People hated Elizabeth Olsen because she was accused of Tyler Cruz and stuff. I don't even remember that. Is it bad that I missed the Marvel heroes? Yeah, dude, seriously, those were the best. I I missed that game so much. It was so great to like I don't know, I just love the way that it was so easy to like let people drop in and out. We need a 2021 version of the Mushroom Rain. You know, I don't think I ever actually completed that. I never really did raids in that game. Do your parents worry about you being an Avenger? Uh, they aren't really in the picture. I take that back. I did complete it one time. AIM scientists are fighting AIM forces. They want to defend. Help them. I call this a target-rich environment. Stay All right, we only got three floors to go after this. I 
I really do not like his locked on power. We'll see you, Chase. That raid was fun. Yeah. I I just didn't really like raids. When I played on PC, I really played alone. Like, I didn't... It wasn't as easy for me to, like, link up with people there, I guess. I don't know. What I loved about Marvel Heroes, it was just like such a low key game to play. Like I could just log on and get lost just running through Midtown for a few hours. Not have to like really think too hard. Like as much as I love this game, it, it takes like a lot more concentration in a lot of ways. A little bit more intense. Whereas with Marvel Heroes, yeah, I mean, you had to pay attention to what you were doing, but like, I could kind of go on cruise control with it, if that makes sense. And I, it was just a game that I, it was a mindless, a little bit mindless. I didn't have to like, really like, I don't know. It was one of those just nice, relaxing, mindless games I could play, where I just love to like, level up my characters, you know, try to keep prestiging them. Like, I don't know, I just, I just miss that aspect of it. I, I get it, like, get the like, reason why I love playing games like Marvel Future Fight and Marvel Strike Force is I just love building the characters, and that's kind of how I felt about, like, Marvel Heroes. Welcome back, Kenny. I'm definitely going the wrong way. Yeah, Midtown boss resets every 90 seconds, right? But that was the fun part, you know, chasing after everything. These enemies must be defeated. I'm not really paying attention to uh, to his gear right now. These are not like I just wanted to get him to 150. I'm not really. I'm weird, okay? Like when it comes to building my characters, I don't care about any of the gear until I get to the end, and I have him at 150. So it's like, all right, fine. I've got him there. Now let's start finding the gear I want to keep, if that makes sense. What's happening, Joe Fisher? Uh, still wish they made Havoc playable. Yeah, man. I wish all... Like, weren't they going to... I mean, HBK may know this. Weren't they uh, trying to make all the... the, the characters that were team-ups playable? Like, wasn't that the goal? Yeah, I just like... It's a fair question. I don't... I don't pay attention to any of the gear until I get to the end. Welcome back, Agent Phil Coulson. You can even come up here. Yeah. 
Oh, that's why I brought pick others up because I can't use them. Ah. Miss some old Marvel TV shows? Like which ones? Like Agents of Shield? All right, three floors down, two to go. I wonder if Moon Knight would be in this game. I mean, he could be. I don't think it'll be anytime soon, though. Speaking of Moon Knight, have you ever seen the Moon Knight memes? Flying looks fun. It is indeed. Love this one. In your eyes? I can't say that I have. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating like all of them. HUD. Good thing I brought enough arrows for everyone. There is a chest with gear close by. Uh, I I saw that there is a trailer for the Batman Long Halloween, but I did not see it yet. Are you for real? Dude, Wizard King, I love broccoli. Broccoli is the best vegetable. I have like perfected cooking the most delightful broccoli Every ever. Of the elite team must be defeated. Bet you didn't expect that answer. Is that Wasp and Archangel were said to be playable? Dude, Archangel would have been dope. Dude, broccoli is... I know I don't look like I eat a lot of vegetables, but broccoli is definitely... I could eat broccoli every single day. I've actually tweeted as such. So here's the trick, all right? Here's here's my epic broccoli recipe. All right, you, you put it in like uh, a pan to roast it. Uh, you wrap, put a layer of tin foil on the bottom. Uh, put all your uh, broccoli in the pan. And then you sprinkle on a bunch of uh, grated Parmesan cheese. And then you cut up like a stick of butter. And then you like put it on top of all the broccoli. And then you cover it with uh, tin foil. And then you put it in the oven at 400 degrees. And let it just sit there and cook for about, um, about a half hour. Conversely, you can just take some tin foil, put a bunch of broccoli in it, do the same thing, cut up some butter, put it in with the broccoli, Sprinkle some Parmesan cheese cover Cover the broccoli up so you got like a ball of tin foil and then throw it on the grill So good rotate it about halfway through So that the butter kind of goes along just thank me later for it. I do not like Brussels sprouts though We're out on the Brussels sprouts It's happening Ecam Giselle hope I said that right uh, Kate might be invisible. She does randomly turn invisible. She's a big fan of John Cena. We have reached the hive's final floor. <laughs> Are you glad you asked? Didn't expect that answer, did you? It's so good. Head for the location on your HUD. I think 400 degrees for about 30 minutes uh, usually okay, makes it um, just perfect. Huh. Easy I guess it depends on the broccoli, but. Sometimes it's a little too soft, um, but if it's too, I would rather it be too hard because then I know I just need to leave it in a little longer. But are we on the last floor? I usually do it on the grill, but because it was so cold. <laughs> Thanks, one box chunky. <laughs> I usually do it on the grill, but because it was so... I live in Boston, um, and it's been so cold, obviously, over the winter. 
I started doing it in the oven, and it's it's really worked out well. I we probably do it like at least once a week. You got a Deadpool pop randomly in a store. Nice. Which one? Oh god, I hate this guy. I just got um. The last Funko Pop I just got was this guy right here. Hold on. Zombie Moon Knight. So that was the last Funko Pop I got. I got two of it. Actually, I'm lying. I think Mantena just showed up from, uh, oh God. from Walmart, but nobody cares about Mantena. Shout out to if you know who Mantena is. Regular Deadpool number 20, nice. My, you know what? I'll tell you what. Uh, my best Funko Pop that I have is a metallic Deadpool from San Diego Comic-Con 2013. Oh my God, there's two of them? It's like a one in 480. I think I have like stepped out. Oh no, thank you. Appreciate that. We are literally about to end this. Just in time. All right, where is the last guy? Right there? Get out of my sky. Boom. Oh. That is, let's see, what are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Give me the chess piece that everybody said I need. Oh, I didn't even call on Hank. Oh, I don't have Hank Pym on here. All right, what are we gonna get? Here comes the exotic. Oh, I think it was not the chess piece. I definitely got an exotic. Oh, I hate this black screen. Come on, exotic. Come on. Well done, Avengers. A hearty Broccoli casserole? I don't think I've ever had that. I would high five you were it not a digital construct and programmed to avoid overly gratuitous displays of emotion. See, you only have Black Widow left. I got you. Oh, I got it. Yo, I got two. Am I supposed to get two? I got the chest piece. Is this the good one? Chance when perfect evading and incoming attack. Increases the... Oh, it's not the right one, though. It's not the chest piece that does the... Uh, the extra arrows. It's okay, though. I got the arrow, though. I, I needed this. Range attacks with cluster arrows. Deal gamma damage. All right, let's just equip that. Range attacks with... Ah, oh, damn it. I don't use pulsar ammos. Or darrows. So both of these were no good for me in the grand scheme of things, but I'm going to level this one anyway. I don't like either one of these. I don't use Pulsar Arrows at all. But at least this will put me like three away from 150. So uh, Unbox Chunky, I play this on both Xbox and PlayStation. So I, I would probably have everybody at 150 already if I only played it on one console. You got stuck with two gloves? That sucks. Um, so yeah, I would probably have everybody at 150 if I just was on one of them, but I like to go back and forth. Um, so this chess piece really doesn't do anything for me. I'm not like, I mean, I do evade a little bit more with Clint than other people. 
What is this one? Chance parrying, gradual powers burst for chronically injured. Yeah, I. Uh, I probably should just equip it anyway. I don't know. I'm gonna hold off on it for now. I don't want to make any like rash decisions. All right, guys. So, what do we have for this? All right. Well, we streamed for three hours and thirty-four minutes. Uh, I got to show off lots of hats, <laughs> um, and we completed the entire Mega Gauntlet. Uh, so. I think I'm going to call it a night on that note. I appreciate everybody stopping by. I hope you had a good time. And uh, tomorrow, I might stream late tomorrow. I have something secret that I'm doing um, that is from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. So I don't know. But yeah, exactly, Disciple. Deuces.